I appreciate you guys and I love y'all so much and I'm here to bring y'all another collective reading okay um you guys okay so I am picking up on the energy of things are definitely about to be restored in your life for some of you guys I am hearing that you've been drained exhausted you've been putting in a lot of work but for some of you guys you've been giving your energy to other people okay people that don't deserve your energy I already pulled some cards, my bad, y'all. I already pulled some cards already. We're going to go ahead and jump into this. And this reading is going to be for July the 30th to August the 6th, okay? We're going to get like an overall message on what's going to be coming on. I mean, what's going to be going on next week. But, um, y'all, the first card that came out, look, we got masculine, okay? Um, I feel like this is y'all energy. Woman or man, take it how it resonate. Um... You are reclaiming your energy. A lot of people have been draining you. Um, like I said, for some of you guys, you've been exhausted, depleted, just feeling drained. I'm picking up you guys are calling back all of your energy. And I'm also hearing a portal. You're about to go through a portal or some type of phase in your life is fixing to end. Okay, if you've been going through a lot of darkness or I'm hearing scarcity or just feeling stuck or lack this is being removed all right i feel like for a lot of you guys you could be an empath and you are picking up on a lot of energies that's around you are still connected to your energy so spirit could be calling you guys to call back your energy here i'm picking up block it's time to put up blocks when it comes to certain people in your life but major changes are coming in and i do feel like this energy is coming from <clears throat> this is coming from the Lion's Gate portal is what I'm hearing. Um, spirit is coming in to restore your life, okay? Whatever you've been working on, you guys are trying to manifest for yourself. This is about to come in. I know I just heard it's a long time coming. For some of you guys, you've been waiting a long time to receive this. But it was certain lessons that you were still needing to learn, okay, before this manifestation came in. I'm picking up on delays for some of you guys, okay? We also got abundance coming out. Look, abundance. And this says Hunter Moon. Now, the Hunter Moon is in, is in October. Okay, I think it's October the 20th. It's like three days before Saturn go back direct. Okay, but I'm picking up on abundance, you guys. This is like your harvest is coming in. But I feel like for a lot of you guys, you're going to receive this sooner. Okay, you could be receiving this sooner than October. But by the time that October get here, you're going to be good. Um, I'm also picking up attention or a lot of recognition because if you look, this woman is standing in the forest here, but all these animals are gathered around her. Thank you, boo. All these animals are gathered around here. It's gathered around her. It's like they're trying to figure out what she's trying to say or they're wanting her attention. A lot of people are going to be wanting your attention is what I'm hearing because whatever this is, you guys. This is about to put you on a new level, okay? This is this is about to put you on a new level. I feel like you guys, you don't gain a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge um, regarding your spiritual journey. I'm picking up regarding your spiritual journey, um, your soul path. It's what I'm hearing. You've been removing obstacles out of the way. You also been trusting spirit. Some of you guys, you've been getting out in nature, or you could um. You can go outside at night or something. I'm picking up you guys are really connected with nature. But something is going to be illuminated to you is what I'm hearing. Because even though it's dark, it's a lot of light here. So something is going to be illuminated for you. Okay? And I do feel like this is regarding your manifestation. And in the middle of this reading, y'all, look, we got the path. Okay? And it got number eight up here. So this is giving me August. This is giving me August, but this is also giving me the line gate portal, which is 8-8, okay? 
So you about to embark um, on a new path here. I feel like you finna leave motherfuckers behind, okay? You ain't got time to stay in this darkness or stay in this low vibrational energy. You're leaving the dark and you're going into the light. You're about to go through a new portal here, okay? Um, Spirit is wanting for you guys to keep the faith. I feel like for a lot of you guys, you've still been trying to hold out faith that things was going to change in your life. Um, I do feel like you guys, when you go through this portal here, things are going to get a lot lighter for you. This woman look very calm, okay? But she's also giving birth to something. So for some of you guys, you are about to give birth to something new. For some of you, you could be pregnant if you are. Congratulations. But um, I'm picking up peace. Uh, peace. That's all I'm hearing off of this card. Um yeah, it's like you could have been worrying a lot or you've been stressed out a lot. But it's like when you go on this path here, you're not going to have nothing to worry about. Because I feel like for most of you guys, all of the hard work is already done. Like you already done put a lot of energy into something here. Okay, are you about to do this? We also got boundaries. Okay, so you guys, you had to set up firm boundaries in your life when it came to certain people. Now, this could be exes, this could be somebody you're dealing with, this could be friends, this could be nose-ass family members, this could be punk-ass associates, whatever you want to call them. But you had to put up some firm boundaries here, <clears throat> is what I'm saying. I Yeah, what I'm saying here. <laughs> you had to put up some firm boundaries, okay, is what I'm saying, you guys. <laughs> I'm getting a lot of channel messages, and I'm trying to, I'm trying to catch them. But I'm picking up that somebody is going to be trying to come in and apologize. You see how this bubble is like this, but that flower is like penetrating this bubble. Somebody is going to be trying to come back into your life and apologize to you. But I do feel like you guys, you're, sta you're standing firm here. You're not going to let nobody... Um, mess up what you're not gonna let nobody mess up what you got going on or what you're trying to create for some of you guys you are definitely going to put yourself in a bubble because i'm picking up on success wealth finances something is going to be changing big time regarding your finances here and you feel like you got to protect certain people you got to you feel like you got to protect yourself from certain people because they could be coming back in your life but it's not they don't have good intentions for you is what i'm hearing they don't have good intentions but you guys you can definitely see this um i feel like for a majority of these people they already done expose who they are so it's like now that you know that these people don't have good intentions for you you're removing them out of your life okay i do feel like Whoever they are, you you guys, they was trying to cause a lot of doubt in your life, okay? They was trying to keep you stuck or keep you confused or some of you guys, you've been doubting yourself that this change was going to come or I'm picking up stress, pain. For some of you guys, the people who hurted you, they caused you a lot of pain, all right? And it could have been hard to move on from this. But I feel like you guys are here. I do feel like also they've been trying to project their anger onto you. Or I keep hearing confusion, causing confusion in your life. Um, yeah, but these people know they're guilty. They know they're guilty for what they've done. Okay. Um yeah, and it's like they wanted to keep you at a low vibration or they wanted to keep you stuck with them. But y'all not finna stay in this bullshit. Y'all finna move on here. I'm picking up like a major death and rebirth is taking place in your life. You're leaving the past behind and you're moving on. This says I'm learning that endings are merely beginnings. So you, you are walking away from... I'm hearing destruction, okay? A lot of destruction, a lot of pain, hurt, darkness. Um, you're leaving this behind, okay? And you are embarking on a new beginning here. You're moving on. For some of you guys, be careful because I'm picking up that there could be people who's, like I said, I keep picking up on people who's wanting to come back, all right? They could be coming back, but I'm picking up blame. They could be blaming you guys for 
certain things that happened to them or they could be trying to put blame onto you. The reason why things didn't work out with them. All right. And this don't just have to be relationships, y'all. But it's like these people are refusing to take accountability in their life. And for a lot of you guys, you're realizing that you're not even on the same level with them no more. You're not on the same frequency with them anymore. And it's like... <laughs> I don't know. I just saw Neo on, on the Matrix when he held up his hands and all the bullets stopped. So if they're going to be throwing things at you, I'm picking up like blocking. You guys are about to block this shit. You're not going to let this interfere with your energy anymore. Okay? They failed. If they was planning on your downfall, they failed. Okay? Spirit is removing this. Uh, for some of you guys, I'm picking up on control. Somebody was trying to control your life control the outcome or they was trying to stop you from manifesting they fail spirit is not gonna let these people come in and take away what you've been working on what you and spirit been working on here it says i understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn i feel like it's gonna take these people a while to learn though y'all <laughs> i'm not gonna lie it, it, i'm picking up on very stubborn energy very controlling energy here that was trying to keep opportunities from you or it's like they was trying to keep you guys from shining or something here and some of them they could have been doing this intentionally but others of them it wasn't intentionally is by you guys being connected to their energy this was draining you they was pulling on your energy is what i'm hearing you guys so we got the tower it's coming down all right. Anything that's not built on a solid foundation is coming down. Okay. Spirit is about to rebuild your life on something solid. For some of you guys, it's something going on in a home or something going on with your family. Um, Spirit done exposed this. For some of you guys, you done found something out about family members or people you was dealing with. Um, I just heard I'm not going to be the sucker no more. So, you're not finna fall for these people bullshit or for their shenanigans, all right? Some of you guys, you could be a Scorpio. Um, but I'm hearing that Pluto, um, Pluto got a major effect uh, regarding this situation. Yeah. Something is going to come into y'all life that it's going to be a shock. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, it's like you're going to be surprised. With what spirit is bringing you. Okay. That's what I'm hearing you guys. It's with the five of cups being here. I'm, I'm picking up on the energy of you healing. Like whatever this tower that's coming in for you. You're going to heal. Alright. This tower is bringing in healing energy. I feel like you guys are going to be releasing. Letting go. Surrendering. Walking away. Um, really learning the lesson from this situation i'm hearing you're going to be learning a major lesson okay regarding certain people and i feel like spirit was wanting to open up your eyes so you can see this before your abundance start coming in here these people going to be feeling real guilty though okay we also got the page of wands coming up you guys you about to take a new direction in your life this is coming out on the path okay you're about to take a new direction in your life. For some of you guys, you could be creating something new or, um, yeah, I'm picking up on creativity or a new path or something you're about to do. You're about to change up the game is what I'm hearing. Whatever you are about to do, what, what, whatever you and spirit is about to do, it's going to cause a major death and rebirth, but I'm picking up, you're about to elevate. You're about to elevate to a new level here. All right, some of you guys, spirit has definitely been dropping gems. If I can talk, for some of you guys, spirit been dropping gems on you. If not, y'all going to be receiving this this week. Okay, I'm seeing with the will of fortune, things are definitely about to change into your life. There's a major cycle that's ending and a new one that's coming in for you. Um, the people that you guys have left behind, they're going to be stuck in this low vibrational frequency. And like I said, you're about to elevate. Spirit is about to put you on top. For some of you guys, you're about to be a star or 
I keep hearing you about to express yourself. Thank you, boo. You about to express your, yourself or show the world what you're made of. All right. I'm seeing you guys step outside of your comfort zone. Um, and this is giving me like a compass. So I'm also hearing your north node. You guys, your north node is fully activated at this time. And you're going to be feeling this heavy um, for the next two weeks. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. I'm also picking up major changes, you guys, regarding your life in general. I feel like your style is about to change up, like the way you carry yourself, the way you walk, the way you talk, the way you dress. Um, for some of you guys, you could be renovating your home or you're going to be buying new furniture. I'm picking up fresh energy. Fresh energy is moving in for you guys. Um, and look, seven of cups. Y'all get ready. Get ready. Major opportunities coming in for you. And I feel like this is regarding love, money, um, happiness, victory. But be careful about these people trying to come back. Is what I'm hearing. You got snakes that's wanting to come back into your life here. All right. And like I said, whoever this is, and I feel like it's more than one person. This is somebody who love control or somebody who is seeking to control your life or control the outcome or keep you from getting something or keep you from getting away. But spirit is opening up the floodgates in your life here. And like I said, for some of you guys, you was experiencing delays because of these people. All right. But now that you see the truth, you're going to move on from this. You finna cut these people off here. I just heard um, back in the day when I was young, I'm not a kid anymore. But some days I sit and wish I was a kid again. So, for some of you guys, you was dealing with some uh, really childish people. And it's like, sometimes you wish you can get on their level, okay? But you don't evolve. Something about your spirit has evolved. Or you done went through some type of DNA activation here. And you just don't even have time to be bothered with these people anymore. Like I said, I saw Neo. It's like you're just going to hold up your hand and that's it. You're not going to indulge into, in this low vibrational energy anymore. You're moving on and you're focusing on the brighter things in life or what's to come. I'm hearing you're walking away from the past. For some of you guys, you've been stuck in the past in your mind. And it's time to move on from this. Okay, I'm picking up like energetic blocks. You about to move on from this, you guys. Spirit, what's what's the situation? <clears throat> situation. Ooh. Ace of Cups, baby. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles, baby. What? <laughs> what? What? You can't tell me nothing. I just heard. Ah. ah, ah. <laughs> Wait till I get my money right. I'm sorry, y'all. My throat is gone. I've been talking. I've been doing a lot of private readings. But it's like, wait till I get my money right. So, yeah, y'all, like, spirit is coming in to restore you, to fill up your cup. I'm hearing love. <sighs> Some of you guys, you've been lacking, giving yourself self-love, self-care. You finna do this, okay? I'm also seeing a lot of money come into your life or abundance. Whatever you guys have been planning or whatever you're about to plant, baby, this is it. I'm hearing this is it. It's time. It's it. You don't, you don't, you have learned a lot from the past and you're releasing this. So now you're open to receive. You don't remove the old energy so you can receive this new energy, is what I'm hearing. For some of you guys, you got new love coming in. All right. You also got a true soul tribe that's coming in as well, especially if you was dealing with people that you thought was your friends. You got real people that's going to come in and support you. But with the three of swords coming in in the reverse, y'all, I'm picking up healing. All right. You about to go through a major healing in your life, in your finances, in your love life, in your home. Um, Spirit is removing everything. I'm picking up anything that was blocking you. This is being removed. Spirit, what's influencing this? <clears throat> if I can talk, y'all. We got the Ten of Swords. Yeah. You done been back, you done been backstabbed. You done been betrayed. Um, people done lied on you. <laughs> 
I just heard lied on, lied on, cheated, cheated, talked about, mistreated. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, you don't been through a lot. Okay, this is definitely influencing this new path or this new journey that you about to take. I feel like you guys done found out a lot about certain people you was dealing with. It's over. It's over. It's over, you guys. At a cup. I mean, eight of pentacles. Y'all about to put the energy and the work into yourself. A lot of detail. Um, this is you getting very focused about your life or you having the energy to work on um, whatever you're building or creating. I'm picking up new ideas. New ideas for some of you guys. Um, yeah. You got new creative ideas that's coming in for you. And this is, I'm, I keep hearing this is it. This is it. So, you guys, whatever you're working on, this is it. Okay, it's like these people, when they did this to you, it made you go harder. Is what I'm hearing. Because like I said, for a lot of you guys, they were trying to hold you back or... It's like they were trying to beat you down or keep you in this low vibrational energy. But this is making you stronger. I just heard what don't what don't kills me make me stronger. Okay? Spirit, what else? The sun. Look, this is Leo energy, y'all. Something coming in during Leo season. So get ready. All right? Um, I'm picking up on expression. I keep hearing expression. So whether this is you using your hands, you talking, you uh, standing up for yourself, I'm picking up on expression, all right? Things are about to get a lot clearer for you. I'm also seeing a lot of healing take place regarding your inner child here. It's like for some of you guys, you're going to be tapping into your inner child in order to manifest this new beginning. It's like you got to go back to when you was a child. The things you used to love to do are like tapping into your creative parts of you. It's what I'm hearing. But this is going to be very successful, you guys. Spirit wants you to get ready. Get ready. It's what I'm hearing. I just heard the best is yet to come. Spirit, what's the challenge? What's the challenge here? Eight of Cups. For some of you guys, it's going to be hard for you to walk away from certain people. All right. It's going to be a little bit difficult. But it's like you know you got to do this. The world. It's going to be hard for some of you guys to close out some cycles here. Yeah, we got the King of Pentacles coming out in the reverse. For some of you guys, you could have been dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. Um, but this is a very greedy person. Like I said, somebody who's very controlling. This person could have played a lot of games or... I'm picking up reckless. This is like a reckless energy or somebody who was depleting you financially. Okay, for some of you guys, this could be an ex here with the King of Pentacles. It don't have to be. Thank you, boo, for the heart. It don't have to be, but this could be an ex here. It's like this person, for some of you guys, this is an ex. And they're wanting to come back into your life. And you could feel this, especially if this is a divine counterpart or a twin flame. But spirit is wanting for you to block this energy. Make sure you're setting up those boundaries here. Because this person haven't changed. This is somebody who's only out for themselves. And they don't care who they hurt. But I do feel like you guys are walking away. Because these cups are empty. Alright? Thank you, boo. <laughs> Thank you. These cups are empty. You're going after your ninth cup here. Yeah, Spirit, what's the outcome? What's the outcome? <laughs> oh, how long now, Spirit? <laughs> uh, okay, y'all. Hold on, wait. <laughs> 
So we got the Emperor in the reverse, all right? And we also got the Ten of Swords, and it says everything is fine. So whoever this controlling person, like I told y'all, it was somebody who was very controlling, somebody who was overdoing their manipulation. This person is very stubborn. This is somebody who feel like they don't need to change. It's what I'm hearing. I do feel like you guys found out the truth about this person. This is somebody who done backstab you time after time after time. Something done been exposed. Okay. Um, but I feel like you guys are not going to let this get to you. Um, you're moving past this. I'm hearing moving past this. Like, you can't deal with this. It's like, I'm actually seeing somebody, like, walk over someone. Like, if you if somebody's laying on the ground, it's like you guys are going to walk over this person and just keep going. All right? You, you're not, you not finna stay here or stay stuck on this person or on this situation here. All right? I am seeing someone wanting to rush in very quickly to talk to you. This is um, giving me, like, a hasty type of energy very impulsive all right it's like they're they don't want you to get away or i'm picking up gaslighting all right this is somebody who's going to be projecting their anger onto you they frustrations onto you or trying to rush in okay it's what i'm hearing i just heard plead my case Somebody is wanting to plead their case, but this person is not coming from a healed place and this person is not coming from the truth. I just heard you a lawyer. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, whoever this is, they're very immature. I don't care if they 30, 40, 50 years old. This is somebody who's very immature here and they act like a kid. Like I said, they childish. I'm picking up on the energy of somebody who never grew up or like mentally they never grew up with the eight of wands coming in in reverse y'all gonna be blocking this person you ain't got time to hear this shit you ain't got time to hear this you ain't got time to indulge in this type of energy like i said look y'all <laughs> i just saw uh the image of neo again when he held up his hands when them bullets was coming towards him this is like you guys blocking all this shit like i, 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 I don't want to hear that shit get the hell away from me you know you need to go on by your business <laughs> But yeah, y'all gonna be blocking blocking this person energy with the eight of swords in reverse. If you guys been stuck in your head, you're coming out of this. You're being released from this energy here. I'm hearing freedom. Um, a lot of freedom. You're about to free yourself from this situation. This is somebody who's been keeping you stuck in your head too long. And like I said, they've been setting up energetic blocks. Your chakras need to be clear. You don't need to have blockages in your heart chakra, in your solar plexus, or your sacral chakra. You, you can't do that when you're manifesting, okay? It's like this person was dimming your light. But by you releasing yourself from this person or from this situation, from this person control, is what I'm hearing. You're releasing yourself from this. You got abundance coming in. Look, three of cups. So this is giving me like soulmate energy, um, soul tribe, like your true tribe is about to come in towards you. Um, I'm picking up on celebration. Okay, good times ahead. Some of you guys, you didn't know why you were stuck or why things wasn't moving. It's because of that energetic core, y'all. It's, it's A lot of people might not believe in it, but if you are focusing on someone a lot and they focusing on you and they already operating in a low vibration, you can definitely, they can definitely be siping your energy. And I feel like for a lot of you guys, that's what was going on here. Spirit, what else? Ooh. <laughs> uh, for some of you guys, you were dealing with Aries, my bad. But look, y'all. Okay, so we got the four ones and we got the justice card. So balance is being restored in your home, Okay. Uh, like I said, success, celebration, happiness, good times is coming. Um, I just heard your best season is yet to come. So, you guys, the fall season is going to be very big for you as well. It's like you're not going to be in the energy you're in right now. Uh, by the time fall come in, you're not going to be in this energy. I feel like it's going to start in August and things are going to get lighter and lighter and lighter. It's what I'm hearing here. For some of you guys, you finna purchase a new home or whatever you're building or working on, you're going to have 
the finances to purchase you a new home or relocate. I am seeing a balanced connection come in as well. For some of you guys who are single, you're going to have somebody who's going to come in that's going to be balanced or they're going to match your energy, okay? And with the four of swords, I'm getting rest. <laughs> I'm getting rest. Like, I just heard after a long day of work, you're going to be able to rest. But I feel like you guys have been working longer than that, okay? I'm picking up for a while for some of you guys. But it's like, I'm getting the energy of, I did it. Okay, it's done. It's like a relief. Like, finally. That's, that's what I'm getting off of this card with the Four of Swords. And I keep hearing peace. You're about to have some peace in your life. All right. Yeah. We also got the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Your energy is being restored, okay? And I just I keep hearing next level. You are on a next level, especially regarding um your spiritual journey, okay? Your connection with the Most High is a lot stronger than what it used to be. And I just heard I'm so I, I'm so I'm so I'm so proud of you by Drake. So spirit is wanting for you to know that spirit is proud of you. You know, you don't overcame a lot. You don't healed yourself and you're moving on here. A lot of balance. I keep hearing balance being restored in your home or if it's something going on with your children, there's a lot of balance that's going to be coming in here as well. For some of you guys, you could be a single mother here. You're going to be able to take care of your family on your own. Okay. Um, but you are going to have help. But something about you're going to be able to do this on your own. Okay. Yeah, let's see what I got, y'all. Let's see. Let's see. Right. Spirit, show me what else I need to see for the collective. Thank y'all for all the gifts and the hearts and everything. <laughs> Thank you for um tapping the screen for me, baby. <laughs> Whoever that is, thank y'all. I appreciate y'all. Like I said, TikTok don't give everybody notifications. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the collective. I'm picking up on a lot of energy, you guys. I'm seeing, I don't know why I'm seeing like a lot of people around me. It's like I'm seeing people surrounding me right now. Um, We got floodgates. So the floodgates are definitely opening up in your life. I just heard it will show. So whatever spirit is about to give you, this is going to shine. Like people are going to be able to see that you on another level or you, you have entered the 5D is what I'm hearing. I just heard God's gift to the world and earth angels. Some of you guys are definitely earth angels are chosen Spirit is about to bring all of this abundance in your life. And for this to be the first card to come out, this is going to come pretty quick, you guys. All right? It's going to come pretty quick. This is talking about prosperity and support. Like I said, you're going to have a lot of support from people. Okay? And this might not be the people that you've been dealing with, but I'm picking up new people coming into your life. You're about to receive some good news here. And it's like you're about to see your manifestations. Major success is coming in for you. Spirit, what else? Akashi Records. <laughs> you can't make this up. Look, y'all. You're receiving the key to your wish fulfillment. All right? You're receiving the key. Whatever you guys been been wanting, you guys, you're about to get this. Spirit, give me another card for the light work. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Let me put some pimping in it. Look at this, y'all. We got the light worker coming in in reverse in Capricorn. Some of you guys, you was dealing with a Capricorn here. That's what I'm hearing. Um... <laughs> this person was trying to drain your light, okay? They was trying to keep you from shining. 
somebody was overdoing their manipulation and their control. This person is very unbalanced, okay? This is an imitator. I just heard play God. Somebody like to play God or they like to act like they know everything. It's like they refuse to take other people's advice. This person is upset because they lack purpose in their life. This is somebody who still is holding on to a lot of pain. And I'm picking up that this person is distracted by you or what spirit is bringing you. They could know that you're doing something or you got abundance coming in. This person could be very materialistic as well. I'm picking up you guys are moving past this shit. I don't, I don't know why I'm seeing a goat like butt somebody in the butt. <laughs> it's like you're moving this low vibrational energy out of the way. Yeah, this is somebody I feel like they're lacking discipline in their life. This is somebody who needs to um, take responsibility in their life as well. This person is very stubborn. Like I said, you guys, they was trying to stop you from shining here. But spirit is removing this. Spirit removing this. I'm picking up hater and jealousy. This is a hater here. Look, irresponsible. And look, y'all, Saturn in reverse. Saturn is still in retrograde. Whoever this is, they better stop because they got divine karma coming towards them. This person lack focus. They very reckless. Okay. Bad karma is attached to them. And like I told y'all, this was this is what was stopping your blessings from coming in. For some of you guys, you were still attached to this person, still talking to them, still interacting with them. Okay. Um, you realize you needed to cut this energy off here. Okay, this person is receiving a lot of bad karma or they, they are about to. This is also somebody who can have father issues. I'm picking up like abuse in a home, some type of abuse. Okay, it could be a struggle for this person to release the pain that they went through as a child. This is also somebody who's very codependent and they're wanting for you to stay in their life or they're wanting to control you so you don't leave their life. A lot of depression is around this person. And look, look what they say, Capricorn and Aquarius. But I'm getting heavy with Capricorn, you guys, for some of you. All right, for some of you. But I'm, I'm picking up on stubborn energy. Somebody who's been refusing to change. Spirit, what else? And for some of you guys, the reason why you was getting bad karma is because this person was still attached to you. Is what I'm hearing. But you are, you're cutting the cord. Soul tribe. I kept picking this up so heavy. Some of you guys, you are attracting your soul tribe. And I feel like that's why I was seeing all these people standing around me. Um, you got a real family coming in. For those of you, like if your family turned their back on you or betrayed you in some type of way. For some of you guys, you had to remove old friends because you outgrow these people. The people that spirit is bringing into your life is going to support you in a major way. It's going to be a lot of healing, okay? A lot of healing, a lot of advice, a lot of give and take, okay? A lot of knowledge. You could be sharing knowledge with your soul tribe here. I'm also hearing people who can put you on the next level, okay? Um, I just heard friends in high places. So some of you guys, you're going to be attracting friends in high places, okay? Look, Leo, I'm telling y'all something coming in during Leo season. You ain't telling me nothing, okay? Some of you guys, you could be a Leo too, but I'm just saying, y'all, I'm excited. I'm loving this energy here. Um, your energy is being restored, okay? Look, see, I'm picking up on activation. Your energy is being restored. You're calling your energy back, okay? And it's like you, you, you're able to see clearly now. I'm picking up on a discerning spirit, okay? And like I said, the people you was dealing with, they was keeping you in a fog or keeping you 
confused or stuck. Yeah, I'm getting like gray clouds. Uh, we got 5D. You're ascending. These people can't stop you. They could have wanted to dim your light here, but they cannot stop you. You are going to the 5D. You're going on this new path here. And you can't take everyone with you. You got ancestors that's around you that's guiding you at this time. Um, you're evolving. I'm hearing at a high rate. You're evolving in your life. Some of you guys, you're about to become more, um, I'm hearing structure, discipline, and routine. Consistency. Consistency. I'm, I'm picking up like you're going to be coming up with a plan or you're going to be strategizing. You're going to be taking time out to ground your energy as well. And like I said, something about your spiritual path, you done elevated or you done evolved here. It's like spirit is going to be talking to you very clearly. All right. A lot of messages is going to come in for you guys. I'm seeing you become whole. Like everything is is about to fall together, okay? Everything is going to come back together here. Yeah, that's what I'm hearing. Some of you guys, you are attracting um something about you attracting a true soulmate here as well. And I keep hearing building your foundation on truth, love, and prosperity. Yeah. Spirit, what else? What else, Spirit? My throat getting dry, y'all. <laughs> Got the Queen of Swords. I told y'all. Y'all some warriors. Y'all are. Y'all done been through a lot. You done went through a major spiritual battle. Um, I just heard all my life I had to fight. <laughs> Some of you guys, you've been fighting this battle your whole life. And I feel like you you don't want the war, okay? But I'm hearing discernment. You're going to be able to see clearly. Like, if you got enemies that come towards you in the future, you're going to be able to tell these people. Or you're going to be able to call these people out because you done seen this and people you done dealt with before, okay? But I'm getting warrior, this is you taking your place on your throne and you standing firm, putting up firm boundaries. I'm here. I just heard I'm no longer naive. So wisdom, a lot of wisdom around this car as well. And I'm getting you going to be protecting your empire. Okay. Your enterprise. Okay, spirit. Um. <laughs> that's my word okay i just heard your queendom all right uh for your for the men kingdom but i i specifically heard queendom all right <laughs> um but you're going to be protecting this you work very hard to achieve what's coming towards you all right that's what i'm hearing you guys anything else spirit what I say, y'all gonna be able to spot them. <laughs> you're gonna be able to spot them in a crowd. You're gonna be able to spot them. Okay, you're gonna be able to see the truth about people before they even come your way. You're gonna feel it on their energy. You're gonna feel it on their spirit. Okay, it's what I'm hearing too. Like for a lot of you guys, you don't went through a purification, or you could be celibate at this time. But I'm specifically hearing purification. So you've been cleaning out your system um, mentally, physically, spiritually, and emotionally. So it's like your energy is pure. You're going to be able to tell toxic energy when they come towards you. All right? Yeah, greedy ass people that want to come in and get what you got. Envious people, okay? Yeah, you're going to be able to spot them. That's what I got, you guys. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see. What else for the collective? July the 30th to August the 6th, Spirit. Show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see for the collective. Well, Spirit, not that much. Sticking to my hand, too. <laughs> Ooh. So 
yeah, we got, if I can pick it up, we got like a sandal here. You about to get to walking, okay? Like I said, a lot of you guys, you're going on your, your path here. You're about to enter this portal. Things are definitely going to change, you guys. Some of you guys, you don't believe this. You could feel like I'm just gaslighting you, but <laughs> I just heard that. But Spirit wants you to know, move. This is your, this is your time. This is your season. Um, you're definitely about to enter into a new era. All right. Um, for some of you guys, you could be. I'm I'm seeing somebody walk on the beach with flip flops on. Um, you're gonna be able to take vacation or go to places you haven't been before as well i don't know why i'm hearing that um i don't know if it's a poem or quotes um but it's like it's like somebody was having a talk with spirit and they was telling spirit everything that they went through and something about them feeling like they was alone and spirit was like the footprints you saw in the sands was mine i was carrying you Okay, something about spirit was carrying you. You might went through some stuff, but it wasn't as bad as it could have been. Spirit was carrying you through your storm. That's what I just heard. Okay, uh, we got the sewing machine. You guys, you could be you could be sewing clothes or making clothes or creating something. This also is like creation to me. So whatever you've been putting in your energy or your hard work into. Um, this is going to be very successful for some of you guys. You could be wanting to start your own brand or your own clothing line. This is also going to be very successful, but I'm picking up heavy regarding your creativity or what you're trying to manifest. You don't put in the work is what I'm hearing. We also got horseshoe. So this is talking about good luck, good luck, good fortune, success is coming your way. But I'm also picking up the energy of blockages. Like, I'm picking up, like, good energy coming in. And spirit is going to be blocking bad energy from coming in. Okay? That's what I'm seeing here. I'm seeing, like, a doorway with money and abundance and all this coming in. But I'm seeing, like, dark shadows. Spirit is going to be blocking these people from coming into your life and interfering with your abundance here. Okay, some of you guys, you could ride horses or you could be in the country. Okay, um, but yeah, I'm picking up good luck, you guys. <clears throat> and it's funny, look, y'all. So <laughs> we got the sewing, sewing machine and we also got this dress. So I am picking up for some of you guys, you're going to be making clothes. But I'm picking up like spirit is making you over. I keep hearing that too. Like your whole life is about to change. The way you walk, the way you talk, the way you dress. <clears throat> For some of you guys, you're about to buy a new home. Okay, this could be coming up in the future. But I'm picking up major changes, you guys. Um, <laughs> I just heard moonlight spot spotlight. So... This could have been hidden from you, okay? Our spirit has been hiding this from your enemies, but you are about to be placed in the spotlight. And I just heard shine. They want you to shine, okay? Don't let nothing hold you back because this is meant for you. And if you've been doubting this, let that go, okay? This was just a period. Um... This, you could have went through like a streak of bad luck, but Spirit is saying that this is over with, you guys. Your life is being made over. I'm picking up on newness and renewed energy here. That's what I got, you guys. You are definitely going to be walking in your divine feminine energy. Woman or men, take it high, resonate. I just heard hold your head up high, know who you are. Believe in yourself. You can do this. I just heard you are enough. So for those of you who've been down your, yourself, spirit wants you to know that you are enough. Okay? 
I just heard it's time to put on your pearls. <laughs> I think that's my grandma. I just heard it's time to put on your pearls and don't throw your pearls to pigs. <laughs> I think that's like an old saying in the South. Okay, don't throw your pearls to pigs. So, yeah. Y'all, that's what I got. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed these messages. <laughs> I did. I can feel the energy shift, you guys. This is awesome. I love this, you guys. Make sure y'all standing in your power and don't let nobody um tell you what to do or try to make you do something. If you know these people ain't no good, walk away from them. Keep them boundaries up, okay? So, y'all, that's what I got. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Spirit kept giving me so many messages. The energy is so high. And it's like when Spirit give me messages, I see flashes, flashes, flashes. And then I hear words because I'm clear audience too. So I'm like, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I'm sorry, y'all. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> it will be going so fast sometimes. Like I said, the energy is very high. But I hope y'all enjoyed this message. Get ready because a major change is coming in here. Um, I keep hearing stop doubting yourself. Stop doubting yourself. Okay. I love you guys so much. Thank you, Valencia. Thank you. Thank you, boo. Yes. Yes, y'all. I'm excited. And when I saw these two aces come out together, <laughs> together, this is big. This is big. Okay. Aces, this is coming from the most high all right yeah get ready <laughs> you're welcome boo thank you guys for being here with me thank you guys thank you for the hearts yes god is so good everything happened for a reason you guys sometimes we don't understand it until after the fact but a lot of clarity is going to come in for the reason why you guys had delays or the reason why something was happening. You're going to have clarity. Okay. You're welcome, boo. Thank you. Thank you, guys. <laughs> I could feel the anxiety before I got on here. And I'm like, Spirit, you're going to have to help me control this. For some of you guys, you've been sitting in a lot of anxiety. Or you've been worrying a lot. Okay. It's time to release and let go and ground yourself. I just heard, um, talk to me. Spirit wants you guys to talk to him, okay? So, yeah. Yes, yes, me. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, guys. Also, y'all, if you would like to purchase my Chosen Journey deck, it's very dope. I done had a lot of good reviews on it. Um, the link, my throat dry. <clears throat> The link is in my bio. Okay, y'all definitely go over there and check it out. I love this deck. Um, I work so hard on this deck, y'all. <laughs> but I'm creating. I got two more decks that I'm going to be releasing soon. And I will let you guys know when they come out. Um, you guys, if you want a personal reading by me, it's a $15 donation. And the link is in my bio. You can use Cash App or PayPal. Um... Or if you want a private reading, you can click that link and you can order a private reading from me through my Etsy shop, okay? Um, but y'all, that's what I got. Oh, also, you guys, make sure y'all subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will be going live over on YouTube a lot more, especially when the kids go back to school. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> Uh, when the kids go back to school, I will be going live on YouTube a lot more, okay? So, y'all definitely subscribe to my channel. And I love you guys so much. I'm finna go ahead and see who done purchased their reading. And I'm gonna go ahead and get started, okay? You're welcome. Y'all welcome. Y'all know I love y'all. I can't wait. I want y'all to tell me about it too when it come in because it's coming. Especially if you already been putting in the work, okay? If you ain't been putting in the work, it's time to get the work. It's time to come up with a plan. It's time to strategize. It's, it's time to cut certain people out of your life or certain behaviors or habits and get focused. I'm hearing get focused. 